Well, first and foremost, I would like to apologize because it wasn't something that anybody wanted or that was expected. Elizabeth Clay is the former general manager at Bay Valley Resort and Conference Center. Clay tells me she is helping the owner with the sale of the property. As we've reported, some people had events scheduled here for later in the year. Now they have to find a new venue. Clay says anyone that had an event booked should have or will be hearing from Bay Valley. The sales manager will be reaching out to everyone that um, had an event. She, I know she's this week. Clay tells us Bay Valley continued to book events because that's what the owner wanted his staff to do. Do you want us to continue booking events? Should we continue? He always said yes, if it was worth it, you know, because his intention was to stay open. Clay is quick to point out Bay Valley did not ask for a deposit, a COVID precaution. Clay tells me that she believes that Bay Valley will not reopen as a hotel and conference center. There is a purchase agreement in um, the works, I believe. I know that the pros potential owner, he does not intend on keeping it a hotel. Um, he's looking at making it a medical facility. Clay says that purchase agreement should be finalized in August. She wants everyone to know closing was never the plan. It was something that became necessary. He is at a point where he doesn't know what to do. He's 74 years old. He lost a lot of money. He just wants somebody to buy the business. Clay tells me the golf course will remain open for this year at least. Reporting in Bay County, James Felton, WNEM TV5.